The number of people who are able to visit Mecca and Medina, Islam's holy cities, has increased every year. To accommodate the influx of pilgrims, Saudi Arabia has spent billions of dollars to improve the city's tourism and hospitality infrastructure. Western brands such as this KFC behind you have found a place here outside the Grand Mosque. The Saudi Broadcasting Corporation transmits live from the Grand Mosque 24 hours a day. The CCTV cameras also add an extra level of security. Mecca is the most holy place of worship for Muslims and therefore only Muslims are permitted to visit. The Kaaba, the cube structure there in the center, is Islam's holiest site. The Kaaba is revered as the physical representation of the house of God. It houses the black stone believed to have been given by Gabriel to Abraham. All over the world, Muslims face the Kaaba when they pray. Here in the Grand Mosque, Pilgrims walk around the Kaaba seven times to symbolize the unity and harmony amongst them in their worship of God. Other sites of Islamic history, like here, atop Mount Arafat, or the Mountain of Mercy, just southeast of Mecca, commemorate the site where Prophet Muhammad gave his final sermon calling for Muslim unity. What we find outside Mecca's sites is what we find in any other major tourist city around the world. Souvenirs and ice cream trucks. Also museums with endless queues to enter, high-end restaurants, and impressive architecture like the Royal Mecca Clock Tower there across the square, which houses a luxury hotel and is crowned by a clock five times the size of Big Ben. Here in the Abraj al Bayt Mall, only a few hundred meters from the Kaaba, the shops close during prayer time. The mall's close proximity to the Kaaba make it a desirable place to pray. Millions of people travel to Mecca every year from all over the world. With so many annual visitors, consumerism has found a way to exist alongside the common rites and practices of the spiritual pilgrimage.